Hey love bugs, it's Roslyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family, just thank you so much for being you, walking in your true self going towards that positive path that can take you towards better days. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell at the bottom so you know when I'm about to open up. Uh, upload my next video and if you feel like you're comfortable enough please go ahead and drop a line or two i love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up telling me about your impact the gift and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction and once again thank you so much for the love and support and if you feel like the video has been very informative formative to you and you feel like you would love to share with a loved one or a friend please go ahead and do so and while you're at it go ahead and give me a thumbs up like and even share on your social media favorites almost did that totally backwards but thank you again for the love and support once again and for the love for the channel and i hope you're able to uh resonate with the content of my video jesus oh that was hard to say somewhat <laughs> but anyways my meditation music that I'm listening to today is 432 hertz or cleansing, balancing all chakras, opening up, uh, opening all chakras, chakra healing, and heal, heal chakras. Oh my goodness, that's a tongue twister. Today, my video is about Twin Flame 101, Twin Flames getting closer in union. Yes, there are so many articles and stuff that I'm hearing on different um, sites that um, on social media that how they're getting closer I'm here hearing about twin flames getting married or they're meeting up or they're finally getting that text back finally from their their twin flame some of them are going through narcissism with their twin flame and they're healing from that but you know you have to show yourself love for you to get that love as well so it's just like more and more every day it's like I get that love it's like we have um, if you have multiple twin flames, I don't know if y'all are, you know, healing or you just come to that ending conclusion of setting free. Because there's, I, to me, in my opinion, we have multiple twin flames, but we have that ultimate one. You know, we have to go through those multiple twin flames, whether it's, it's a sexual relationship or just, you know, acquaintance relationship or, you know, you're just passing through just to get that closure from many millenniums ago for you know from the way I felt from it coming from me so it's just like all the ones that I've had is either that you know we passed on um our relationship and it's just no longer there or I've you know just came to closure with it but the ultimate one is like you know with my father being in passing and being in spirit he's been so supportive um he has always been there you know just cheering me on and it's just like I've been there with him, and, you know, with him like working all over the place, doing his little light work duty as an angel or whatever he calls himself. You know, he, he burns a lot of energy because there's so many people that reach out to him, you know, want to get closure and just missing him and stuff like that. So he's all over the place. And it's just like, you know, I feel that, you know, and it's just like some people ask me, you know, when, when your father died or whatever, did you feel that closeness with him and did it get different, you know, become different? I said at that time, you know, before he had passed, you know, I never knew what my relationship was with my father. I used to always just constantly have dreams about him, but I knew in my dream and my higher self knew what he was, but as me being in my human form, that veil had not came off yet. So, but when after all that came about and we got to know each other more and stuff like that, my dad, you know, I actually opened up because it was like a wall that was there I wouldn't allow love to come in so it was constantly being blocked off and you know it made him hurt and go away but when I was welcoming to it not running because I was the runner he was the chaser you know it, it became more closeness it became more in that oneness so it, it's just like we're going through this you know you're probably feeling the love and support from your twin flame as you're giving that love and support too and it's just like they're always around you know, a lot of times people are like, are we going to connect with our twin flame? You have to remember, you know, even though they say union, it's not really union because we're all one. You know, we're always together. Even though we're not physically together, we're always together. You know, you're in their head all the time. They're always in your head all the time. So it's just like when you're figuring that out, knowing 
that your twin flame can't save you because there's sometimes that you know god and universe will send something down you know telling your twin flame hey you know i'm gonna come save you i'm gonna come save you you're not supposed to be saved you have to be able to save yourself rise above so you you know y'all both can get in that union be in a physical form together for me i don't know what's gonna go on because my dad's not no longer in that physical form so it's just like you know i i can't think about that right now it's just like i know my dad's there my i get that support there i know that he you know that there's love there so I just keep going to where whatever my mission is, I know the universe will supply, you know, that ultimate soulmate for me, my ultimate twin flame and whatever that is the store for that. I'm content with that. So it's just, you know, you got to keep going and going. You know, you can't worry about the union. And sometimes it's hard to do because, you know, you want that, that, that physical connection. You want that so bad. But you have to keep going and doing what you have to do. And knowing that, you know, the universe is going to help out with that union. So I hope, you know, everybody that's going through this, you know, you keep your vibes up, you know, be that support system for your twin flame um, as they be that support system for you, knowing that they're always there. Anytime you need to talk to them, just talk in your head. They'll always hear you. If you have any questions, you know that the universe will supply the answers for you as well. So I hope you all having a blessed day week. I missed y'all so much, but I'm back at it once more again. <laughs> So, send out much love and light, and my po my post notification goes out to uh, Ray Fisher. Much love to you. I hope you have a blessed, safe weekend. I hope you had a blessed, safe weekend, and you know your journey is blessed as well. Sending uplifting vibes and loving vibes your way as well. And as always, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites. Drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback or the content of my video, or you're just up telling me about your empathic gift. And remember that I have live chat going on throughout the noon as well as in the evening time. You can come in and chat it up with us, have fun, have a laugh, or two, or maybe even three. And I will see you on my next video. Send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. Know that you are blessed, truly favored, highly loved, and knowing there's always somebody out there praying for your better days. And I will see you on my next video, or maybe I'll even see you in my chat. Much love to you. Peace. And be wild.